Good day everyone, I'm teacher Tasha here. So today we'll be learning about uh, sets of militant and also permanent uh, which is uh, it is a uh, content in a uh, science year 3 DLP, DLP science which is dual language program and it is in unit 3 human content standard of 3.1 TIT while learning standard is 3.13 which is compare and contrast sets of multit and permanent teeth. So in this small brief um, video, we'll be looking through, we'll be comparing and also contrasting the multit and also permanent teeth. So kids, make sure you give attention. It's very important to know the differences between multit and also permanent teeth. So that you can differentiate the multit and permanent teeth easily. So for multit, have to know milted is baby teeth. So milted, always remember it's for babies, which is babies. While permanent teeth is for adult. For who? It's for adult. So let me put it here. So it'll be easier for you. So it's for babies. And then it's for adult. Later I'll adjust it for you guys. Okay. So it's for milted are for basically for babies and permanent are for adult. So very simple here. What you're gonna do compare and contrast now. So milted have 20 teeth, which is 10 teeth in each side. You can see here the picture here it's showing very well. The, the, the cross section is showing very well. And it is smaller in size compared to the permanent and it is less strong. That's why you cannot uh, babies are much uh, advised to have uh, soft food and the lifespan of milk teeth is very short while as, uh, whereas for the permanent teeth it has 32 teeth which by whereby it has 16 uh, teeth in each section it is bigger in size compared to the milk teeth of course right because Permanent teeth are for adult while milk teeth are for babies. So of course permanent teeth will have, will be bigger in size. It is very strong. That's why you can see all the people can just cut through those chickens just nicely like that because they have a very strong teeth. And the lifespan of the teeth are very long. So you have wondered why they have a life why I'm saying that the lifespan of the teeth is very long for the permanent teeth. So you should have uh, realized by now, because year three science was uh, nine years old kids, all the milk teeth will started to fall one by one. So it will be replaced by the permanent teeth, which it will be with you until you get old, and it will start to fall down. So that's are the differences between milk teeth and permanent teeth. This is a very uh, brief topic. It's a very simple to topic to understand. So I'll be adding. Uh, a quiz uh, in you can see under the video I would have put the link link below it's from quizzes you can answer it very simple questions and I'll be adding this screenshot of this um, uh, Jamboard in my blog so please do visit there also and for if you have any questions you can put it below in the comment or you can email to me so I'll be providing all the information and below the this video. So just make sure you are going through all those uh, informations. So that's all for today. So good day, guys. Uh, have a good day and make sure you stay inside for this MCO. Okay. So that's all for today. Thank you.